Good morning. Hi, happy September 21st, 2021, 9, 21, 21. Yes, I sleep in makeup and the shirt I wore yesterday. Um, so this morning I am going to, before I even get this day going, I'm going to take out my Bible and I'm going to read just one verse because I love, I love word before world. Yesterday was rough. It started off rough and, um, I'm tired. I gotta get the kid, these kids going. Um, word before world. I'm gonna get in the word before I get in this world. Even if it's just one sentence, I'm gonna connect with God. It's like when you visit a friend, it doesn't matter how long you visited or really the details of it, it's more that you visited. It's that you popped in to say hi. So I am gonna pop in and say hi. I'm gonna just open the Bible and I'm going to read, again, just um, just even one verse, word before world. Then, to get over some inertia, here's a little trick for the morning. Do five self-care things. So, <sighs> brush teeth, wash face, put contacts in, change my clothes and then drink some water. Five things, just do five things. If you're totally exhausted, five things. And it'll be, you'll be amazed how um, much more pep you have in your step. I'll go do five things after I get in the word. Hebrews chapter 12, verse one and two. This is the verse that's on my basement door. The race of faith. Therefore, we also, since we are surrounded by so great a cloud of witnesses, let us lay aside every weight and the sin which so easily ensnares us, and let us run with endurance the race that is set before us, looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, who, for the joy that was set before him, endured the cross, despising the shame, and has sat down at the right hand of the throne of God. Let us run with endurance, keeping our eyes fixed on Jesus. Amen. Hair, face, teeth, contacts, clothes, even lotion and lip gloss. Time to start beating people. We've got to get going. I'm moving slow and I just want to sit here, but I have kids to care for, Bible to read, and dishes to do. I've got to read two chapters of Nehemiah today so I can get caught up and done with Nehemiah by the end of September. I'm going to set a timer right now for 30 minutes and in 30 minutes I'll read two chapters of Nehemiah and I will do those dishes. It's been two minutes and so far I've texted a friend. I think I need earplugs. Let's do this. Earplugs and that black stuff that football players wear on their face. What is that stuff called? What? I can't hear you. I like to highlight God's word and then use an ink pen to write down my thoughts in the in the margins. And sometimes my thoughts are just emojis. Nehemiah's efforts being challenged by enemies and Nehemiah tells the nobles, the officials and the rest of the people, don't be afraid of them. Remember the Lord who is great and awesome and fight for your brothers, your sons, and your daughters, your wives, and your homes. Don't be scared. Can I get the dishes done in four minutes? I believe I can. Let's see, which dishes do I want to do? I think I'll do those two. Dishes done. Check, check. Done with three minutes to spare, and I might use that extra time to do a few more dishes. And then I'll homeschool these kids. All five of my kids actually go to public school, but two of them are still quarantining until next week. I love eating this way. Peanuts, canned vegetables, and an early bedtime. See you tomorrow.